Monday morning. You wake up. You want to send the, the group chat on WhatsApp a funny good morning meme. You want to go on Instagram and see if the local thought showed her nipples on there. Or you might want to go on Facebook and see if a MAGA riot may consume. And you notice the little pinwheel thing is up. You think, damn, maybe it's my Wi-Fi. Let me reset it. But you realize Pornhub is still playing in the background, so it's not your Wi-Fi. You then come to the conclusion that Instagram, WhatsApp, and Facebook are down. You're like, all right, cool, fuck it, whatever. I'm gonna ignore it. An hour later, still down. Three hours later, still down. Six hours later, still down. What's the first thing you're thinking? Uh, shit, for me, that shit was... So my SIM card on my phone mm -hmm. wasn't working. So Brokey. I, I don't know why. My SIM card <laughs> just randomly stopped working, so I couldn't call or text people. Uh -huh. And... Instagram wasn't working. That's like my other primary thing of communication. And yeah. I'm like, all right, I have WhatsApp. Let me do the ghetto shit and fucking take their numbers and try to hit them up through WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. That shit was down. Yeah. I'm like, oh shit, I can't talk to anybody. So I was uh, secluded that day. Yeah, I was yeah, secluded. Yeah. I couldn't talk to nobody. So, so I, had to, I had to reach out. I had to go to Snapchat to try to reach out to people. <laughs> and people, don't, people don't even use Snapchat. So I'm not, I was left on. No one's even no. opening this shit. I'm like, oh shit, okay. I guess I'm uh, secluded. I was, I was hitting up people all through group me. <laughs> I'm like, damn, that's embarrassing. Yeah, it was, it was pretty. I was account. down bad. I was down yeah. bad. I'm not gonna hold you. For a while, I was confused. I was like, damn, like, what the fuck is going on with Instagram? Um, I kind of ignored it, and I was really busy at work anyway. Um, so I'm on Twitter now. I'm realizing everybody's having this problem. Mm -hmm. Cause sometimes like Instagram will be down, but it'll be a few people's yeah. problems. Once the memes start coming, yeah. Once Every I saw Twitter tweeting, like, Twitter was making tweets. Like, like yo, what's up? <laughs> like, yo, it's good. Everyone's here now. I think it's bad arrogance. So, what's up? Literally everybody. <laughs> That's yeah. what he said. The arrogance Twitter has is fucking hilarious. Mm -hmm. But I want to start off with the, um, let's start off with just the overall consumer part of it. Like, how people reacted and shit. I think we have a fucking problem as a society. Because mm -hmm. I don't know about you, but every hour... I went right back to Instagram. <laughs> it was like... You know what's funny? I feel like none of us even like Instagram. We're just on it just because. Yeah. Twitter is like, we like Twitter. But Instagram is like, uh Instagram was that thing where it's like, you took it away from me, and now I want it back. Yeah. But if I have it, I don't give a shit. It's a good time consumer. Yeah. It's like, it's just fucking awful. Man. I was fucking embarrassed about how many times I checked Instagram to see... Yeah, me too. Yeah, I, I, I used it many times, especially because like, my shit wasn't working. So I was like, oh, I got I to gotta yeah. contact people. Ugh. Like, I wasn't even concerned from a business perspective of the podcast. I was just like, I just want to see what niggas is doing. Like, <laughs> just checking this shit. I felt like a dope fiend. Like, I was like, oh, got to get the stuff. Got to get yeah. my fix. And like, that's crazy. That's fucking embarrassing. Like, the overall dependence we need on Instagram yeah. to the point where we're losing our shit. Like, niggas is tweeting, y'all, I thought my Wi-Fi was down. Like, you stupid motherfuckers. the only Google thing you use your Wi-Fi like, for. Yeah, like, <laughs> YouTube works, dumbass. <laughs> your Wi-Fi works. But the fact that we were going crazy and it's like people are making jokes about how, like, Imagine you have like a real business on Instagram, like people are fucked. Yeah, yeah. And WhatsApp, WhatsApp too, Facebook. A lot of people on the yeah. on those three websites. A lot of business goes down exclusively through there. So, bro, that's a lot a, of people get fucked. It's a long day. Like yeah. all the businesses that use WhatsApp, all the people that you contact each other. Oh shit, that, that shit is fucked up. I, the I stock bad. went down. Yeah, stock went down. B Simone was fucked up. She's selling um what? B Simone. You know, I don't know if you know her, but no. She uh does like she's selling her Instagram stories for ten bucks, like to be on her close friend. She was fucked, man. I was that could have been a big day for her. Damn, she had like a little OnlyFans, but through nah, like, just some private, a regular close friend story like my shit. Oh, uh, like, regular? <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. Okay. Just That's pretty smart for it. Yeah. yeah, but like imagine I was singing this joke on Twitter. I was like, imagine you run an Instagram ad on that day and it's just down. Mm. Just think it's just like you look at your reach and it's like zero. It's like, you know how fucking mad I would be if I ran an ad and then it's just Instagram shut down that day? And they you know got, they're not they honoring that. Yeah, they're yeah. not honoring that. Yeah, that's a lot of money. Yeah, they're not honoring that they shit. Might, they can extend it at least. They gotta give you like a free credit. You know what I mean? Like, I, don't I know. hope, nigga, because everything was fucking down. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you hear even fucking, I don't know what they said. They said the cause was it was like a production issue. Like someone did some bullshit. Eh. No, nigga. Uh, no. I was, I, was, I was dialed into the. I, ooh. Let me get my investigator hat back on, man. I kind of saw this shit from start to finish. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, I woke up in the morning. I'm watching the news. I like to watch um, MSNBC. 
and they're talking about the whistleblower. So that was something separate, though. No, no, that yeah. happened. The whistle. Okay, so look, it's at the same time, yeah. Yeah, the whistleblower thing happened Sunday night. They put it on the sixty minute show thingy, whatever yeah, it's called. But then the whistleblower, all the whistleblower said was like, "Oh, these apps are making themselves addictive to people." Or no, some shit. what do you say? No, the woman said first of all, can't trust a white woman. <laughs> Don't have her in your company. <laughs> but what the whistleblower said about Facebook was they were lying about. Um, I'm, I think I'm going to say the wrong word, but basically like the community guidelines, they weren't really protecting younger kids in um, yeah, yeah. They targeted. their content. And also, they're using specific content to spew more hate. So, like, basically with the riots, like, they're realizing that's where the money's going. So it's like, nah, keep pushing this out, keep pushing out, keep pushing this out. Keep putting content in certain people's eyes that is going to make you drum up conversation but in a more hateful manner, which is not good because of what just fucking happened and I, what I don't think happen. they did that intentionally. It was just the, the way the system worked. No. Unintentional? Yes. She collected all the data because I guess she works directly with that. Um, and she was like, nah, like, yo, they're literally doing this and lying about it to the government saying, yo, it's okay. We have everything under control. Damn. But they're purposely putting it out more to do that because think about it. The more usage, the more revenue you get. So... So that's basically yeah, the whole they thing. want people on there talking spicy so they can just, you know, keep, yeah. keep the clicks going, keep the, the conversation flowing, keep yeah. the bullshit But flowing. the issue with the spicy talk was like, fam, like this is yeah, damn near suing riots. Especially again. with kids involved. And then people. that was another thing, the adverse effect it was having on children, specifically little girls. It was like, yo, like oh, they yeah. feel like um they're actually more likely to be depressed and then want to commit suicide and all yeah. that other stuff. Yeah, they're definitely known and for like, that shit. Family, like the ultimate goal is at the end of the day to protect the younger so, generation. So it's the conspiracy that they went down to yeah. cover that shit up or some shit. I don't, I don't think that's a conspiracy though. I mean, uh, listen, if you want to call it theory, let's call it theory. I feel like that's like most of that stuff was already known about face about those what apps. the the whistleblower shit. I don't know, I could be wrong, but I feel like they had issues, but not I someone that, yeah. exposing them. So that was like always like low key known like oh, okay these things are they're making themselves addicted to children and whatever. Making it was girls, girls like. It was known, mm. but they said they were fixing it. Okay. So the fact that not only were they not fixing it, but they were making it worse purposely, yeah. it's like, yo, what the fuck? Like, you know what I'm saying? It's like you with your girl, and then y'all have a problem. You say, all right, I'm going to do better, and then you just do the exact yeah. opposite, and then amplify it. Like It's like, damn, nigga, you going to cheat twice now? And everyone's like, yo, we need to break them up. They shouldn't be three companies. These three companies should be separated. What's that? Facebook, Instagram, yeah. they shouldn't be together. So, I mean, you know, I'm not necessarily against that, but I don't know. Yeah. So, Instagram, then right after that happened, because now most everybody kind of knows around the morning time. Mm -hmm. It's like it's being aired on all news platforms. It's being put everywhere. So, subsequently, like, right, I think right after I posted the fucking thing, like, saying new episode, like, maybe 20 minutes later, Instagram's yeah. down. Everybody's in a frenzy, and it's like, uh, what was the what was the thing I'm saying? They apparently, well, not apparently, it did. They deleted a portion of the server. I think it's like the DNS server or whatever. I don't really understand that tech stuff, but they deleted a portion of it, and it was like, yo, it's not like like there's an error. Like it's legitimately fucking gone. Like they mm -hmm. deleted like an entire portion of Facebook oh, out sure. from their thing. It's mm -hmm. basically like they just said, nah, like yo, but. People are saying, like, and what I do believe is that they did that because of what's going on. Mark Zuckerberg kind of had to, like, clean shit up, give, like, mm -hmm. a little distraction, like, just to fix some shit, you know, get all their ducks in a row, um, mm -hmm. just to ensure, like, I right, whenever this hearing happens, actually happens, I think it happened Tuesday, whenever the hearing happens, they can just be like, nah, like, we're actually doing this, that's just misinformation, mm -hmm. whatever, whatever, like, they want They're doing it in front of, like, the CIA and shit? Or not uh, CIA, they're doing it in front of, like, uh, the government? Like, yeah, government yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit with the, So, I don't know what portion of the government, I don't know why I said CIA, it's, like, Senate and Congress, whatever. Yeah, like yeah. so, I mean, That's always funny when they grilled him. Remember the last time they grilled Zuckerberg? He looked like a fucking robot. They kept grilling him, that shit was funny. But, but it's I'll just... I'll say that again. You, you saw nuts. what they, uh, what ha also leaked, they, Twitch got hacked, too. Did you hear about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah that was funny. And all the all the streamers like revenue got leaked, and these motherfuckers are making crazy. You see that money. one guy, No Nothing TV. 
Oh yeah, nah, yeah. he's <laughs> nah, he like, he did that himself. He, oh, he's okay. the person that posted it, but he like put his own just to make to make like a joke of himself. Oh okay, yeah, I'm like, oh, like <laughs> yo, this nigga got mad beef with him, like damn, like, it's a zero, nah, nah. You know what he do to y'all? Like, he's the one that like republished it, but he put himself in there just to you know, so his name got clout, but he got zero. That was funny, <laughs> but um, that was a good idea. It was just funny because seeing uh, the amount uh, a lot of these dudes make, and what's funny is a, a lot of those, a few of those people were like political. Like socialist streamers, and they're talking about like, yeah, they're pretending like they're broke. Mm. They, they, they don't pretend like they're broke, but they they act, act like, like they're like, yeah, you're coming out the one percent. Like motherfucker, you are the one percent. What are you talking about? <laughs> like you are Listen, one of the wealthiest people. That's what you got to do to they're make probably, it. Shit, man, man. Get, get your get your bread. They're Listen, if crazy, I start coming man. here every week talking about how much I hate women, you gonna know why? Like it's a bump and views, bro. <laughs> bump and views. Like I had enough of this shit. If I gotta start lying and yeah, shit, that's just crazy. Uh, but but overall, I thought. That entire Monday, I thought it was pretty interesting yeah. how the content space worked with Facebook and just all how that, fucking all that insane shit that went is. down. Yeah, I don't yeah. know. People be addicts on this. How long do you think you can go? Would you do like a retreat where you can't touch your phone? You have yeah. like things like that. You could just for like a day, five days by no myself, phone. or like on my what, like my friends and shit. By yourself? No, you can't do it by yourself. Either that, or I'm gonna start touching. Pretty nice a place. Lot. Start being a me. <laughs> just aggressively. No porn? Huh? No porn though. No, I'm just. Raw dog it? Yeah, straight mind. Straight mind. <laughs> straight mind thoughts just... Oh, I'm going to create an Instagram in my head. <laughs> Double tap. Jesus. Yeah. Get left on scene in the DMs in my mind. <laughs> Whack close friends. <laughs> Stupid. Yo, I need to be taking out a lot of women's close friends. I hate it here. Oh, it's just man. abysmal. I don't want to get back into it. It's just abysmal. Yeah. But, I mean... Yeah, no, I can't do that. Uh, Mark Zuckerberg is a piece of shit. Let me just wrap that up. Is he? No. Sounds like a decent guy. I gotta say something. He's like, cool. No, he's a it's weirdo. It's like you go to his house, he'll cook you some Korean barbecue. Like this? <laughs> hey, would so you like, like some sounds KBQ? Like a really nice, a really nice guy. Uh, you, you he know, doesn't look like it. He looks like a super... He, you remember I, I Am Robot? He yeah. looks like one of those robots. Yeah. Those robots had more charisma, but yeah. <laughs> that shit is a little... Would you like a Tesla? Like, he's a fucking freak. <laughs> he's starting to go on a jet ski? No, sir. <laughs> he's, he's mad goofy. It was like he's fucking person. weird, son. That might be his karma. Wait, hold on. Hear me out, though. All this shit that's happening might be his karma now that I'm thinking about it. Okay. Remember, he did steal um, Facebook, the idea of Facebook from the Winklevoss twins. I forgot so, about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, This might be all his karma. Mm -hmm. Nigga lost seven billion a day. That's light work. Sheesh. Yeah, that's kind of. I'll do seven billion a day. I'm shooting myself in the head. Like, <laughs> sure, I'd be like, damn, I had that much. <laughs> nah, you just in, in the black and the red. Seven billion in the red. In the red. I'm like, yo, <laughs> chief, like, there's seven billion people in this country, in this world. They gotta all chip in. I'll give you a dollar. Yeah, can, can everyone in the planet give me a dollar? Oh man. <laughs> so I can pay off my debt. <laughs> you know what that reminds me of? Like, this is always broken math. It would be like, yo, if a hundred people in the world gave me no it'll be some crazy shit like a hundred million people in the world gave me a dollar i would have one million dollars and it was like what like yeah what kind of fucking math are you doing chief like yeah i've heard goofy shit people are like oh jeff bezos if you take all jeff bezos money it could stop world hunger I'm yes like, okay yeah, that's, that's the one that's the one <laughs> some dumb shit yes that is exactly the one too and i keep people, seeing people, that. they're mad people's math is like they don't really understand the scale but it's funny because when they do it I don't really do the math, so I just be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I do the math, I'm like, oh, no. How much is Jeff Bezos worth? Like, 500 million or something? A lot. Ha he ain't worth having trouble. Enough trailer. to go to fucking space. Like, 100? I don't even know. I'm retarded. This nigga has enough money to go to space, so. That's baller. Yeah. All right, but enough of that.